oh my god, we finally have a Fallout 4 Creation Globe update to be going over with you guys. Again, it's been about a month since we've had a you know, Creation Globe update and really no one knows what is going on anymore with it. I don't even know, I might make a separate video just to say that I don't even know what Bethesda knows what they're doing with it at this point, but it's still really weird that they're just every now and then updating the Creation Club with like no confirmed schedule whatsoever. It's extremely weird and I have had a little peek at this thing and it is a pretty interesting update. Before I get into it though, I would just like to say I have been uploading extremely commonly on my, you know, uh, IRL slash vlogs. I've been uploading a couple of vlogs here and there, but also a lot of music content. If you would like to maybe go and check that out, I would highly recommend you guys go and do, you know, do so. I, I actually did a Machine Gun Kelly album reaction with one of my close friends, which I highly recommend you guys go and check out. Again, all of this will be linked in the description down below. Of course, don't forget to, you know, just go do all that. It would mean a lot. Maybe even comment on those videos saying you're from here. But I guess, without further ado, let's just get straight into the Creation Club video. Alright, we are on the Creation Club store now. For the first update in over a month, really weird. We still got the Virtual Workshop, which is always discounted. 30% off, 1,000, down to 700. Travel to new worlds from the comfort of your settlement with the VR Workshop. Transport yourself to a series of exotic landscapes such as a desert island and the iconic GNR Plaza from the capital wasteland, featuring over 40 new craftable items, weather, and music options near enemy uh, spawns rather near limitless settlement building and four new worlds to choose from. So, again, I don't know why they should just maybe change this to 700 now. It is always discounted. Nothing more reliable than Bethesda discounting the VR workshop. And it seems like the discounts keep getting bigger. I swear this was like 25% a week ago. Or a month ago. It is 30% now. We've also got the ultimate weapon paint job. You know, a kind of bundle which is 25% off. 800 down to 600. For limited time only. This bundle features 11 weapon paint jobs. Including the Army, Adam Cats, Gunners, Hot Rod Pink, Hot Rod Shark, Red Flames, Vault Tech, Brotherhood of Steel, Institute, Minutemen, and Railroad. Together are worth 1,100 credits, but because it is a bundle, it is 800, and of course, it is down to 600 because it's 25% up. So again, do not get this if you're on the PS4. I cannot stress how much to not get this. I've spoken about it many times before, but you can get the zero kilobyte glitch, which basically is a terrible glitch that, honestly, it just destroys your game. It basically says that you cannot update your game anymore, you know, you cannot save your game anymore, rather, because you have zero kilobytes remaining on your console, when in fact you probably got more. This is caused by skins in the Creation Club on the PS4. If you would like to learn more about it, I have a full fix and tutorial on how to stay away from it and how to fix it again, which I will be linking in the description down below. Highly recommend going and checking it out. Now, we've got that aimless, I wouldn't say aimless, but very important plug out of the way, which I always seem to talk about, because there's so much zero kilobyte stuff on this store. Um, we've also got, again, it's just pretty much all skins, by the way, so stay away from skins, just like this one. Ultimate Armor Paint Job Bundle for um, 600, down from 800, originally 1,100. For limited time only, this bundle features 11 armor paint jobs, including Army, Adam Cats, Gunners, Hot Rod Pink, you get the gist. Basically, yeah, it's pretty much the same thing. The Minutemen out armor is so awesome. Even the Minutemen paints for, like, the weapons over here. Just look at that Minutemen paint, dude. Look at that American flag. That is so, so, so cool. One of the coolest things in the whole entire game. How awesome these paints are. So nice. And they they just work. Like, it just really, really works. Especially for role-playing at settlements. It's so awesome. So many people love giving these armor now, these Minutemen paint job armors to like their settlers who they want them to be Minutemen, but they're still called settlers. It just fits in so well. It's so perfect in my opinion. Uh, we got the Real Estate Magul bundle for a limited time only. This bundle includes three creations, including the Nuka Collector, Charles Sound Condo, and the War Penthouse. Together are worth 1,400. Because it's a bundle, it's 1,000, 30% off at 700. Looking really good. There's a couple really awesome ones in here. The penthouse is awesome. Has a really nice story from Remembrance. Um, the other two are okay. The Nuka Cola Collector one is not great, but I believe the um, 
condo is pretty cool as well, and there's a lot of building room there too. Then we've got the Coffee and Donuts Workshop Pack for Slocum's Joe. One of the best creations in the game. I think a lot of you know how I feel about this one. Bring some delicious fun to the wasteland with the Slocum's Joe Coffee and Donuts Workshop Pack. Features over 75 new items, including new architecture signs, lights, decorations, and new animated food crafting stations, allowing you to make your favorite pre-war donuts and coffee flavors. Assigned vendors to run your shop while you're away includes two new Power Armor paint shops. Again, I believe it has a zero kilobuck glitch in it because it's got the Power Armors, but I've never got it on the PS4. I'd say just risk it, honestly, and if you run into the problem, I've got a full fix for it. But yeah, it's an absolutely awesome update. Probably the best, nearly. There's so much variety, so much stuff. You can add the role-playing with it. It's just so awesome. And now it's only $4.50, and yes, it's worth it. Little quest, a lot of things to build with, a lot of animations, and a lot of, like, you know, it's a new vending station. New Power Armor skins as well, which look awesome. Dude, it's just such a cool creation. I love it so much. One of my favorites. Highly recommend getting it. And then we've got some free paints. Again, don't get it if you're on the PS4, but because I'm on the PC, 100% I'm getting it. It's for free, why not? 100 down to zero. Power Armor paint job, purple. Show off new paint job for your Power Armor. And yeah, use some of the some of the pictures of it. Nice and purple. Um, Pit Boy paint job, which we'll get that too for 50 down to three, which is cool. And yeah, looking really, really nice. So this was basically the Creation Club update. A little bit going on, not a whole lot, but yeah, still pretty cool in my opinion. Just a lot of skins on this week's update, a eh? zero kilowatt, you know, glitch dream nightmare is what I kind of want to say here. So yeah, pretty interesting, but yeah, pretty decent update for the first one in like a month. But of course, if you haven't already, please make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel. Don't forget to comment your thoughts and opinions on this down below. Did you guys like this latest Fallout 4 Creation Club update? Did you guys not? Of course, I would definitely really like to know your thoughts and opinions on this down below. Um, of course, you know, go and check out my other videos and content. Links for them will be in the description down below as well. Go subscribe to my sports channel, my IRL slash long channel, this and that. All of them will be linked down below. But as I was saying, please make sure to leave a like, subscribe, and comment. And I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.